Welcome, in front of me is a POCO M3 and today I'll show you how to enable and set up the portable hotspot. And to get started you want to pull down the notification panel, extend it and look for the hotspot toggle which for me looks to be right over here. So once you find it you want to hold it, this will in turn open up settings and in here we can well, change the settings. So let's go to set up portable hotspot and start off by probably changing the password uh, by default as you can see it's just some kind of randomly generated password so let's tap on it remove this one and set our own as you can see once you remove it it gives you this gray text uh, eight characters minimum so you do have to have at least eight characters in length for your password and from there you can basically save it then ssid is basically going to be the uh, network's uh, the wi-fi's name so if you want to change it change it or just try to remember the name of it, which for the most part, almost always, it is the name of the phone itself. Then we have security, I'll keep it as it is. Um, and then lastly, I would say is the AP band right here. So we can choose between 2.4 gigahertz or 5 gigahertz. And if you're not sure what this does, it basically will change the signal wavelength of Wi-Fi and uh, in general, 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi will be faster and more stable while the 2.4 will be used by a wider array range of devices especially the older ones so some dated devices most likely will not support the uh, 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi uh, but anything from like a couple years back uh, should support it so if you're not sure if your device supports it uh, what you can do is simply Turn it on at 5, uh, five gigahertz, uh, enable your Wi-Fi by basically enabling it so, like so, and then go to your the device that you want to connect to this Wi-Fi or hotspot with. Um, look for the hotspot name, which would be POCO M3, and if you see it, then that's, that's it, your device supports it. If your device doesn't see any kind of network by that name, that means that your device just simply doesn't support the 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi. And all you need to do then is go back to the uh, settings right here and then set up portable hotspot and drop it back to 2.4. And that will make it work again. But once it's all set up, you can leave it. And all you need to do now is simply tap on the toggle whenever you need it, like so. And once you're done with it, make sure you turn it off. Otherwise, it will be using a little bit more battery for no reason when it's not being even used. So simply tap on it again to turn it off. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.